U.S. Army. I was stationed at Fort Bragg, North Carolina from 2003 until 2006. In 2004, my unit deployed to Iraq, and in June of 2005, I was injured by a mortar round. It landed approximately nine feet from where I was standing while getting ready to do PT, so I was only wearing shorts and a t-shirt, and it blew me into a building. Um, I am really excited to be here at Camp Atterbury for the Wounded Heroes hunt um, that they have here every year. And um, this is my first hunting trip and I am very excited to be here and can't wait to get the trip started. Welcome to this week's special edition of Heat Seeker Outdoors. Today, we're gonna continue with our special uh, Wounded Hero hunt series and one of my new favorite people, Jessica Griggs. So it takes a lot of people to make this hunt happen. And, uh, you know, right at the top of that list is the Command Sergeant Major, Ty Benham. Uh, from the moment that the hunters arrive to the moment that the last one leaves, it's all about hospitality and taking care of the hunter and, and trying to do what we can to make it successful for them. And, and uh, that all starts right there at the top. So we start out first thing, we take everybody out to the range, uh, everybody goes down, we get targets set up, we're all kind of cutting up, we're, we're uh, getting everything, making sure it's sighted in, and uh, usually we've got a fire going, we're sitting around telling stories. Um, it's a lot of fun, and Jessica's a good shot, so I know if we can get a deer in front of her, it's gonna happen. So we start out every morning uh, while the hunters are here, we start it all out right, uh, we have a big breakfast, um, we all muster up together, and you know, everybody kind of talks about the day before his hunt or what's going to happen, you know. Uh, we all share a lot of hunting stories, and Lord knows that this boy loves to eat. So now we've got Jessica here, we've got her fed, we've took her to the range, and now it's time to get into the woods and yeah, and get this thing going. You know what, I got an idea. Translation, time for me to get to work. Day one, uh, we're scouting. Uh, we've already kind of scouted out. You know, we kind of want to take her down range, show her around. Uh, the weather's not cooperating. Uh, we just, it's nasty kind of rain. Uh, it's not super cold, but just with the rain and everything, uh, just not cooperating wind, all that. Uh, but we're still having fun, so that's what matters. So even though we haven't been successful yet, uh, it's all about the camaraderie and uh, with these, you know, our hunters and everybody that's in here. And so we just love, you know, getting the chance to congratulate the others that have been successful, hear their story, sharing their moment. And it's just kind of a cool thing that we get to do usually at lunchtime and then again at dinner time. Well, the hunting may not be our thing right now, but we're definitely having fun. Bears. window liquor deer <laughs> all right so it's time to get serious
<laughs> My name is Jessica Griggs. I'm here on a Wounded Heroes Hunt in Camp Atterbury, Indiana. Uh, day two. Um, we saw some does this morning. Um, I did see a nice eight point, but he was about 150 yards too far for me to shoot. So we're kind of hanging out, waiting. Uh, we've seen probably a total of eight to ten does um, so yeah we're just kind of hanging out waiting in a redneck uh, blind about 10 15 foot in the air and watching the Sun come up in a big open field and perfect <laughs> I thought he was gonna run when the artillery hit, and I was start like I was starting to cramp up, like I, so I had to I see, move. I see, that's why I'm like I can't, because he was coming too far this way. I'm like I can't see him, and I can't, I couldn't get that like in my shoulder, yeah. and I was afraid like with this being flimsy. Yeah, it looked pretty good though. He he mule kicked, so. Yeah. What's that mean? Well, a lot of times in a mule kick, yeah. kind of you, you hit him. Mm -hmm. you know. He's going to need just a little bit of time, I think. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Was it exciting? What's that? Was it exciting? Yeah. Or is that a rock? What is it? You smoked it. Nice. You see it again. Got you a five point. Yeah. It's a good size. Oh, yeah. Peter, hold his horns. Check him out. What's yeah. that? Check him out. Horns. Check him out. Nice. That is awesome. Great shot. You seriously like pinwheeled him. That, I'm telling you, I couldn't have walked up and pointed 
and had a better shot than that right there. Now how the hell? Oh wait, I should call Sergeant Major. Be like, Sergeant Major, I found my deer, but I lost. We're in the jungle. <laughs> <laughs> I'm lost. <laughs> All right, today is Halloween, Saturday, October 31st, full moon. And we're out here on the 2020 pandemic edition of the Wounded Hero Hunt here up at uh, Camp Atterbury. And uh, this is uh, Jessica Griggs, uh, wounded in action in Iraq, mortar round. And uh, 2004 or five? 2004. 2004. And she's been a trooper. She hung in there with really, really cold weather. And uh, so I give her the, the my, my sick of fanatic jacket. And uh, that kind of helped you sit for a good long time, didn't it? It did. It's very warm and cozy. So we've seen several deer this morning, kind of out to our east, north, south, east, and west. We had every direction deer coming. And, uh, well, uh, I'm quite not, not quite sure what time, about 9.30 or so, we had this uh, guy you see right here come, come downwind of us. And uh, our camera guy put out some uh, black widow deer lure. The only thing I can figure is that deer caught a scent of that and came on a string, come running in. And uh, we had to hurry up and get ready. It was like a Chinese fire drill inside <laughs> inside the redneck tower blind. And uh, well, I think you can see that uh, the 45 or the 44 Magnum that Byron Ayers loaned us did the job. You want to talk about this, Annie? I know it's your first deer. Oh, by yeah. the way, you forgot something up there in that blind. Nice. <laughs> you want to save that? Heck yeah, we'll turn it into a keychain. There you go. <laughs> so, uh, uh, Je I don't know if you could hear it on the video or not, but uh, we got mortar rounds flying overhead, and it's kind of kind of what nailed Jessica. So, uh, uh, had to get her out of the woods pretty quick. So, people says PTSD is not real. Yeah, it's real. Hear that? So, <laughs> you, you okay? We're out in the open now. I'm good. <laughs> so, uh, anyway, the uh, the Sika did its job. The Ozonics did its job. The Black Widow Deer Lure. Obviously, the Redneck Tower Blind. The, one uh, shot, one kill. One shot, one kill. Perfect. I couldn't have walked up to this deer and drew a crosshair on this deer any better than that that's un that's amazing it's been my pleasure to take her and uh, now she's done she's got to take some deer meat to ohio I want to say thank you to the whole team here for the Wounded Heroes Hunt, Camp Atterbury. It's been great. It's been fun. Um, the weather was great. Um, it was exciting to go out and actually do the hunting since I had never done it before. Um, a big, big thank you to the whole team, the staff, the guides. Um, I was fortunate to have two really good, great guides that have camped here, camped here before and hunted here before. Um, so we had a really good time. Um, if you ever get the chance to come and do this hunt, I would definitely recommend it. Um, it's something that you'll enjoy and that you will not be disappointed in. So thank you again. and. I'm looking forward to hopefully coming back in the spring to actually go turkey hunting. So it was another great successful hunt, uh, another new friendship that you know we'll be able to cherish and uh, the time that we got to spend in the blind with Jessica and even her husband uh, Jesse got in on the excitement with us and uh, I think it's just a time that I know none of us will ever forget. Thank you, Jessica uh, and Jesse, for your service. 
to the country and thanks for allowing me to kind of come along with you video this hunt and uh, just be a part of it so thanks for watching heat seeker outdoors